how to edit eyes inside the Magic Touch 2 panel inside the Retouch module. So first of all, of course, open the Magic Touch 2 panel and you will see all these four sections, skin, eyes, lips and hair. We want to retouch basically eyes. So just go into the eye section, click on it and you will see these four options. So first thing first, we want to boost a little bit the color of iris. So just press on color. A layer will be created and we can get rid of the previous empty layer we had there. And with the mask selected, just be sure to have the brush activated. White as foreground color. Right click on the image, be sure to have your hardness set up according to your needs. In my case, I want it to be 0% hard. Let's make the size of the brush a little bit bigger so it fits the iris. Opacity down so we have a nice smooth color coming out and just brush over the eye. And the same thing also on the other eye before and after. So as you can see, we are working on the boost of the color. Why we are using opacity 19%? It's because we want to control the amount of color which is going out from this brush. So of course you can use 100%, but in the case of 100%, you will have immediately 100% of the color. So this way you can basically control how much color is coming out of this brush. So this is the before and this is the after. Okay, so before and after. So it's very nice slight boost of the color. Now we can add some more brightness to this color. So just click on brightness and same situation as before. Be sure we have the mask selected the brush selected, white as foreground color, opacity accordingly to your needs, and we can just boost a little bit the brightness. So now we want to add some more detail to the whole eye, so just press details and the layer is selected. Be sure to have also in this case the mask selected and as before just reveal where you want more detail to have. So like, so in this case, we can play with the opacity. So we reveal the detail faster. And this is the before and this is the after. As you can see, according to your needs, you can make it stronger or less strong. Of course, this eye is out of focus, so no need to to add some detail to something what's out of focus. So this, this could work. And as last uh, feature we have in the eye section is the whiten and it will whiten up this white area of her eyes. I suggest to use it carefully so it's so it, it doesn't seem to be too fake, but just to show you how it works, just click on whiten be sure to be on the mask, adjust the opacity as before and just paint where you want to make it more white. And this is the before and this is the after. Okay, as you can see, I have the pressure sensitivity on, so it's creating these unwanted lines. Okay, so just turn off the sensitivity pressure and brush again. And now you will see we don't have those lines anymore. Okay, so before and after, before and after. If you want to delete some areas you work for mistake, just use the black color on the mask and you will adjust the issue you created. If you see too much white color, just lower down the opacity and you can just adjust what you want. So this is the before and this is the after of our eyes. As you can see, it's a very nice and professional result made just with few clicks.